Hey there, friendship. Before you say anything, I know what you're thinking. Why does that girl on the internet look like the bad guy in the Da Vinci Code? And the answer to that is because I wanted to show you something that I can't find on the internet anywhere, which means that it needs to exist. Maybe it does exist, but I didn't look that hard. If you're wondering why I'm speaking quietly, it's because there's people sleeping in my house, I think. Who are they? No one ever really talks about how hard it is if you go like day drinking and then everyone's like, all right, yeah, rally in a few hours and then let's go out. How fucking impossible it is to put makeup on and get ready when you're drunk. So in order to make this an accurate video, I started as if I went to the beach or something, no makeup, I'm gonna get drunk and I'm gonna teach you all the tips and tricks of how to put your fucking makeup on and you're hammered. So the first thing I gotta do, Let's get drunk. I'm gonna be drinking what everyone always drinks when they're day drinking. What the fuck ever. Law and Order SVU drinking game. Living room. Now. Ding! If you have this, like, sh stuff going on in your neck, that means that you're drunk because your skin's like, Ugh! If you have something floating in your drink, then you know you're ready. Seriously, what's in my drink? Aliens. Still gonna drink it. Here's a helpful life tip. Stand by things that are white because it makes you look less white. <laughs> I think I got too drunk. I got a shiver. You're gonna wanna go to sleep. Fight that urge. I don't recommend washing your face because you might drown. Make sure that your skin is ready for your makeup by uh, flapping it. Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Okay, I'm ready. Make it look like your skin is not so angry at you for your bad life choices. No. Go ahead and have yourself a fucking foundation soda. Make your face look like a different face by piling on like the heaviest makeup you can find and do it with some kind of brush that doesn't judge you. It's okay if you can't see what you're doing because even if your eyes are open, you can't see what you're doing. Make sure you get it on your neck too where it shows how drunk you are. Because the faster you do it like this, the better it comes out. If you can't move your brush good, just move your face. So you don't have time for a concealer, but you have time for powder or when you start crying later about how some boy doesn't like you. So in my opinion, if you're going out drunk, use some dark ass fucking colors. It's the most unforgiving, right? And if you fuck it up, people are just gonna be like, oh, she's drunk. She like fucked up her makeup. And you're like, haha, joke's on you. I did it like that. So you might as well go big or go home because fucking Jesus knows when you're this drunk, you're gonna pick out a bold outfit and you need some bold face to go with your bold outfit. How you doing? You only do your makeup like this because you're sad on the inside. So you know what you do first is that you just make sure that your eyes are there. What I like to do is just take, I don't have a mirror. I just like to take a liquid eyeliner, take one little baby step and now you commit it. There's no turning back. You got the black. Then you just want to put some shit on your shit. Sometimes you realize that you're using blush as your eyeshadow and that that's a mistake. It happens, okay? Just blend it out. What's this? The darkest color I got? Yeah, get it on there. You can't live life fucking half-assed. You gotta close your eye and get that shit on there. If this isn't a good brush, whose fault is that? Not mine, it's yours. It's not my fault, it's your fault. You need to figure your life out. You got one job and you suck at it. Brush, imagine that your eyeshadow is like a delicious fucking spinach artichoke dip, right? Who doesn't love that? Go, go slow if you have to, because it gets stuck in your eyeball. It doesn't have to be perfect because you're already perfect just the way you are. A good way to clean up your day drinking face eyeshadow. Imagine that you're your own like parent judging you. Oh, what did I do? Look at you, you're such a fuck up. Like that, perfect, awesome. Now see how much better that looks? Because you're already drunk, I wouldn't necessarily recommend tools like this, but uh, you know, take some risks, kid. Leave it around in your face a few times, get used to it. Okay, you're good. You good? Nothing, nothing bad's gonna happen. What could possibly go wrong here? Nothing. Watch this. I don't even need a mirror. Oh, but oh, that was right, Matt. Yeah, let's go. What's going on? Like your bathing suit. Hey, buddy. Perfect. Amazing. Gone. Someone's like, oh, dude, you got stuff in your eye. Like, no, no, no. I put it there. 
all right? It emphasizes my irises. The one thing you should concentrate on is just getting some lashes on. Dear male species, when was the last time you glued something on your face? Love, Jenna. Love, I do this all the time. So when you just have a little bit of glue on there, just let it dry for like no time, and then just stick it on your face. I have no concept of time. How you doing? Perfect, awesome, just get it on there. Amazing, come look as good as possible. That ain't even bad. You gotta get your eyebrows on. This is the time when you can afford to take a break. Just be like, you know what? I know where my eyebrows are. Close your eyes, hey. You gotta get inside the waterline. This is the hardest part, you ready? Think about baby giraffe, just, oh, it doesn't feel good. And then you realize that you, uh, you picked a turquoise, so that's your gimmick. Try really hard not to let your eyelids get stuck to your eye. It's not right. It's just not right. It doesn't look right. It makes your eye look all crazy. Get your blush and bronzer up in here. Who's gonna yell at you for having extra bronzer on your face? Nobody. Do I have a beard? Or was I just not paying attention? Open to interpretation. Most important places to get with your bronzer. Here, here, and here. You've already got a natural glow, kind of, because you're drunk. So just make it like way more intense. Everybody loves someone that's so red in the face. Are you embarrassed? No. I'm just excited to be here. I'm normal, I swear. Do you want my phone number? So get some lip liner. It doesn't matter what color it is, because you're gonna blend it, okay? You're gonna blend it. Don't let this scare you. Just shut off your drunk brain for one second. My sober brain is gonna make sure that I show up to wherever we're going looking regular. Your choices of lip color are hoochie, ho, trick, ho shit. Don't forget to put that hoe gloss over it. And then if all of a sudden you realize that this is totally wrong, just problem solve. After this, the only thing you have to worry about is making sure that you act sober enough to get into wherever you're going. I might as well be asleep right now because I'd probably look better, but you know what? I gave it all I got. I gave A for effort. This is this is a pretty good look if you ask me. Up close, you're like, what the fuck? Far away, you're like, yeah, buddy. No, get off my dick. And far away, you're like, yeah, buddy. I don't even know what this video is about anymore. Make sure you subscribe to our, our channel. We put out new videos every Wednesday. My hands may or may not be down my pants right now. Cause it feels good. I think I need to take a shower. This is not a funny video at all. This is some real life shit. Mm-hmm.